Hey guys, this is SB4D and welcome back to another awesome Fortnite video! Guys, I've been grinding this game for weeks, possibly months. I used to play this game on the PS4 and I was a beast at it. And then I came to PC and I was absolutely garbage. And I thought, you know what, I'm sick of this, I'm going to use a keyboard. And I started using a keyboard and I thought, shit, I can't use a keyboard. So then I thought, oh, fuck it, I'll use an Xbox 360 pad. So I used that and then the, the controller was just too big. So I thought, fuck it, I'll use a PS4 pad. And here we are. <laughs> I use sensitivity of six for those that will ask. I use a controller. Um, I don't know. It's just I find it more comfortable. Anyway, guys, be sure to smash the like button, subscribe, drop a comment. Always get involved. It's important. Uh, I want to teach you a few things. Now, I'm not the best. I'm not, I'm not ninja. I'm not a pro. Uh, but I will be one day. I remember when I first started on PC, I was getting my ass whooped. Do you remember that Loki and the Hulk? I quit the Loki because Loki got fucking low-key by the Hulk. He got fucking smashed to bits and that was pretty much me on Fortnite. But if there's a few things I've learned and hopefully you're still listening, you might be able to take away with you and actually be a better Fortnite player for it. Even though I should be teaching you how to be a crap Fortnite player because let's be real, my competition should, uh, should remain as it is. I'm starting to get to the point where I can feel pro and I can feel noob. I'm like the noobs, I kill easy, and then those that put up a fight, I consider a bit of a, a bit of a, a bit of a try hard, and then those that just murder me, I consider pros because you're gonna take a pro to kill me. No, but in all seriousness, guys, shotguns are a huge aspect of Fortnite, so definitely learn how to use a shotgun. The pump and the automatic one, where it's the pump is a shot, load, shot, load. The action pump, which I, think I said that wrong is bang 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 anyway you get the idea my point is is use everything like use the environment to your how can i say this to help you like for example when i just put that staircase up it wasn't a staircase it was a wall someone walks past that wall they think it's a wall no i'm behind it i'm behind it mate waiting don't worry guys i wasn't sitting there all game waiting i could hear somebody walking i thought you know what i'm gonna do this and let them walk past my invisible wall that they don't know I'm behind and then obviously I pick them up. But the shotgun is a huge aspect of Fortnite. A lot of people are jumping. You will notice that with this video. I jump. I'm guilty of that. But sometimes there's some characters, some players you feel like you have to jump to kill them because they're jumping so much you have to jump with them. And the more you do it, the better you get at it. But I would recommend is to bull rush your, your your opponent. Like, if they're jumping at you, bull rush them. And when I say that, I mean run towards them, crouch, stand, crouch, because it's like head movement. Just think of it like boxing or MMA. The more you move your head, the more you're moving, the harder target you are. I kind of think aim assist fucks that up, but that doesn't matter. But as you can see, on this hill, there's a hill. So I'm using the hill to run. I'm using the hill to run down. Yes, he managed to get a couple of shots off from me, but I killed him. It would have been his victory if I didn't use the environment because he's jumping. And that's the thing. When you're jumping with a shotgun, literally, you're pretty much giving yourself a bigger focus. They can shoot you clearer because they're jumping back and they get more of a sight. So what you do, if you bull rush them, you're taking away that advantage. You're bull rushing them and they panic and they're like, oh, I've got to shoot at my, I've got to shoot at my feet. And then they panic and they start building. The amount of people that panic is unbelievable. Here's another tip for you. Build. I don't build enough and I've heard a lot of people say this. I try to build a lot. Especially when we've got a lot of material, just spank building out to get better. But build really do learn how to build yes you might suck at building you might get your ass whooped you might build a ladder upside down you might build the walls on the back wrong way round. doesn't matter naturally your brain is a muscle and it will flex yeah that's right guys it'll flex the more you do something the better you become at it doesn't mean to say you'll become a pro that to become a pro you have to have hardcore dedication I know this because when I was very young, I'm 28 now, when I was like 14 or 15, I can't remember, I used to play Gears of War 1. I used to play that game all the time. Friends used to knock for me, I used to go, no, 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 no. You interrupted me before, play Gears of War 1. And I'm not even joking, I, I wish I did YouTube back then. I used, to, I used to let my team die, don't judge me, just so I could 1v4 on Gears of War 1 with a sniper. I set myself challenges. I become... 
the way I look at it is like Conor McGregor. He says, embrace chaos, embrace fear, become the fear, and then become comfortable with the unknown, and then the unknown will become known. And that's the way I look at my outlook on, on games. I know it sounds silly because it's just a game, but if you really want to be a good Fortnite player, you have to take a lot of these mental aspects into it. You have to, you can't just log on, drop down, and just expect to be a badass. If I'm honest, it's just a matter of how, how many times you die, how many times you kill, how, just how much you play Fortnite. That's how you're going to get good at it. But I know this ain't a proper guide, like, oh, do it like this, do it like that, with, like, fucking rulers and measurement tapes and stuff. But this is more of a mental side of things. The shotguns, bull rush them. Try to jump a little bit, but don't jump too much, guys. Uh, the amount of people I've killed that are jumping, they seem to think, oh, I'm in trouble, I'm going to jump. Jump, jump, jump. Oh, I'm dead. It's like they think because they're jumping, they're, they're, they're not going to get killed. Yes, yeah, sometimes you could be, you can come across someone that is really good at jumping. But I can, there's only a certain level of goodness to jumping with shotgun. So that's what I'm trying to say. I am mastering the bull rush. I jump as well. Don't bear in mind. Keep your, think of your, your arsenal like a mixed martial arts. You've got all these tools you can use. You have to learn. You have to learn, guys. So I hope you learned a few things by watching this, by listening to me rant. If you're still here and you're still listening, I love you so much because it's like, what, six minutes and you're still here. There's still a lot of nice clips to come. And I'm just going to leave you some music. I'm actually going to go watch the Avengers. That's right, Infinity War by myself because I've got three kids and my wife, obviously, she don't like that stuff anyway. She wouldn't watch it. And plus, she said I could go, so I'm going by myself. I know, it sounds sad, doesn't it? But that's what happens when you have three kids. Life becomes harder. But anyway, I'm not going to miss out at that. So be sure to drop a like, subscribe, comment, and let me know in the comments. Give me your honest opinion. Am I a decent Fortnite player from what you can see? And do I appear to be learning? I'm going to do some more of these videos uh, because I like to. I want to showcase a regular player playing Fortnite becoming good, getting better, and so forth. And I hope to inspire some of you guys that are not doing so well on Fortnite to get better as well. All you have to do, play a lot, just watch a couple of streamers, watch a couple of YouTube guides, because knowledge is power. You young'uns out there, listen, believe me, I was young once, I still am, but knowledge is power. And if you can exercise that muscle, believe me, the sky isn't the limit you can go beyond that and then you'll freeze and then you'll just go because it's space not to fire anyway this is sb4d take care you were the shadow to my light did you feel us another star you fade away Afraid our aim is out of sight Wanna see us Alive
Yeah.